Bulgaria is one of the oldest countries in Europe. Archaeological evidence shows that ancient cultures thrived in the region as far back as 5000 BC. The Thracians, Persians, Greeks, and Romans all left their mark on Bulgarian lands over the centuries. The first Bulgarian Empire emerged in 681 AD when the Bulgars, a nomadic Turkic tribe, crossed the Danube and conquered the local Slavic tribes. Under the leadership of Khan Asparuk, the Bulgars established a powerful state that at its height encompassed most of the Balkans. You might be surprised to learn that Bulgaria was among the first countries in Europe to adopt Christianity as its official religion in 864 AD under the Tsar Boris I. This decision had far-reaching cultural impacts. To spread the faith to the common people, the Bulgarians needed a written Slavic language. In 886 AD, Bulgarian scholars developed the Glagolitic alphabet, the first Slavic alphabet, which later evolved into the Cyrillic script, used today across much of Eastern Europe and Russia. Pretty cool, right? The first Bulgarian Empire reached its apogee under Tsar Simon, the Great in the early 10th century. Simon expanded Bulgaria's territory, made key cultural reforms, and even claimed the title of Emperor of the Bulgarians and the Romans, a direct challenge to the Byzantine Empire. However, Bulgaria eventually fell to the Byzantines in 1018 after nearly 200 years of on and off warfare. In 1185, the Bulgarians overthrew Byzantine rule and established the Second Bulgarian Empire. Under the Asin dynasty, Bulgaria once again became a major power in the Balkans. But in the 14th century, a new threat emerged from the east, the Ottoman Turks. After the Ottomans conquered Constantinople in 14053, they turned their sights to the Balkans. The Second Bulgarian Empire fell after the Ottomans captured the capital Tarnovo in 1393. For nearly 500 years, Bulgaria was under Ottoman rule. The Ottomans abolished the Bulgarian state and suppressed Bulgarian culture. But the Bulgarians never lost their identity, language, or Orthodox Christian faith. In the 19th century, a national awakening spread across Bulgaria as scholars, rebels, and church leaders worked to revive Bulgarian culture and agitated for independence. After the Russo-Turkish War in 1877-78, Bulgaria finally regained its autonomy, becoming a self-ruling principality within the Ottoman Empire. In 1908, Prince Ferdinand of Bulgaria declared full independence, establishing the modern kingdom of Bulgaria. However, Bulgaria backed the losing side in both world wars, leading to territorial losses and periods of political instability. After World War II, Bulgaria became a communist state within the Soviet sphere of influence. For over 40 years, Bulgaria was ruled as a one-party socialist state, until the communist government resigned in 1989 in the wake of larger anti-communist movements across Eastern Europe. In the 1990s, Bulgaria transitioned to a parliamentary democracy and a market-based economy. From ancient tribes to medieval empires to a modern European state, Bulgaria's complex history reflects its position at the crossroads of Europe and Asia. Shaped by its struggles for autonomy and identity in the face of foreign domination, it has emerged as a nation proud of its unique cultural heritage and traditions. Today, as a member of NATO and the European Union, Bulgaria is writing the latest chapter in its long and fascinating story. What do you guys think about this history of Bulgaria? Let me know in the comments below. See you in the next one.